one of the things I love about Abbey Park is this um, outdoor miniature railway that you can actually ride and sit on. It takes you not, not around the whole park, it's just situated in one corner, but it's a good little probably three or four minute journey around on the tracks and it's only £1.50 a person to have a go on. The only sad factor is it's only open on Sundays and the bank holiday Mondays. Um, which is such a shame, I would love to take a, a little bit of footage uh, showing you it going around. If I can find some previously, I'll try and insert it, but I don't think I've got any footage of it. But it, it's a great little uh, thing here. The, the park's got everything. It's got a playground for kids, it's got this kind of little thing for the kids, and big kids. Um, it's got some wonderful uh, green areas, and hopefully, during the run, we're going to be taking part in uh, some of these because it looks like we are due to come alongside this railway because I have just noticed as I entered the park Caution, runners oh, That'll be me Right, time to go and find the start I'm doing my best for Leicester Tourism Board today I've even taken you to the uh, Chinese Pavilion uh, area of Abbey Park which I think is, is so fantastic and they've even now built a little bridge over which I believe this is part of the River Saw I'm probably wrong on that it's probably just Abbey Park Lake and I've got my geography all wrong but this is fantastic look Normally, it's, that's the kind of warning I get from the wife when I try and be a bit cheeky. Normally, I'm on thin ice. What it says underneath. Okay, no swimming in there either, although they have covered up the no swimming. So I'm wondering if we can now swim in there. I'm gonna guess no. And even if you can, why would you want to? Doesn't look particularly nice. So here we are then, we're at Abbey Park, ready for the park run. Um, now I believe we start somewhere over on the right hand side of what is called the peanut uh, locally, because it's roughly very shaped like a peanut. Um, you will be taken in, or I say you, me but you through the video will be taking in the majority of this park because that is only roughly about two two and a half k we will be crossing the river saw and we will also be running around the western side part of abbey park as well coming back along back over the bridge and i believe we've then come back around to pretty much where we started or so i believe i haven't done great research on this uh, route um Miniature railway, like I pointed out earlier, that takes you round here. Um, now, in my previous video, you would have seen um, a little bit of the history side of Leicester, why it's such a great city. We've got the Abbey Ruins here, this is why it's called Abbey Park. Now, there's a lot of history here, but just very briefly, we can actually trace these Abbey Ruins all the way back to the 12th century. Um, it was uh, only excavated probably about 100 years ago. Uh, it kind of got lost over time, but we do actually run past the ruins as well. So I'm going to try and get some of that footage just to show you. But this goes all the way back to 1143. And there is so much history just about Abbey Park. So genuinely, if you've got a little bit of time on your hands, give a Wikipedia, give Google a look, and it will tell you all about that. That is uh, some interesting stuff just about this grounds. Right, we're gonna make our way to the start now. Let's see how many hundreds turn up. See you in a bit. All our pink bested volunteers. Keep this free. 
We don't have priority on the park, and it's only our second event, so some people will not be used to see you lot hurtling by. Please give them due courtesy, because we don't have priority on the park, and say hello as you go through. We have a number of milestones, but in particular, Neil Lancaster, who did our um, first time as briefing, is his 100th park run today. <laughs> Park run. Here we go. Come on, Hi, Lorraine, come and say hello. <laughs> Good morning. I always find you somewhere, you don't do, I? Don't you? London, is... Leicester. <laughs> yeah, why not? <laughs> just just globe trotting. <laughs> um, this is your first Abbey Park run as well. It is. It's only the second week going. Um, so far, so good. Nice and flat. You enjoying it? So far. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, why did you want to try Abbey Park? Well, well, it's a bit different. And so, we're sporting fellow squirrels on their long run for the Leeds Marathon. We are indeed. So, I'm going to try yeah. and get those at the end as well. If yeah. I don't, Amy and Helen, best of luck to you both. Fantastic achievement with Leeds. Good luck. Right. And well done to Lorraine as well. And Heather, who is somewhere, I haven't seen her, uh, probably ahead of us actually. Um, you both completed London Landmarks Half Marathon. We did, yes. And if you want to see that, right. got another video linked just above. And these wonderful ladies Lorraine and Heather are actually featuring it yeah <laughs> so go back and check those out as well right head down push on see you in a bit Oh, oh, oh. 
Right, got my barcode. Top 100 today, I'll take that. Got my Parker and barcode on my watch, see if that works. Hello, buddy, you're right. You're right. Uh, which one do you want first? Yeah, I want you first mate. Thank See you. if that works. I did your I saw your video about the that's the half you did. Oh cheers, buddy. Yeah, I appreciate really that. Thank video. you. Really hey, good. two weeks time, mate. This one will be up as well. Oh, nice one. I'll keep a lookout for that. Am I going to be on? I'll tell you what. Do you want to say hello? What's your name? Um, my, my name's Ibs. Ibs. I'm, uh, volunteering at Abbey Park Parkland, which is the second one. So make sure you say thank you to all your volunteers. Thank you ever so much, buddy. Take care. <laughs> Thanks to volunteers like Abe's handles all around the park, so we can do these five k's for free every Saturday so if you ever do a park run those are your people so let's give you some thoughts about the Abbey Park run then for me personally this is the best it is 99.9 percent .9 tarmac um, and I love running on tarmac can't stand the grass uh, the only bit I started on the grass was right at the beginning uh, and that's because there's just hundreds of people to try and get around the secret is well and truly out about Park Run Abbey Park. The only other finish, uh, the only other part that's grass is the finish over there for about 20 metres. So for me, this is perfect. Near enough flat all the way around, apart from the bridge you've got to cross twice. And although today wasn't meant to be a PB, my watch suggested it might have been. So we'll wait for the official results to come up. Uh, I'll post them down here and let you know as well. However, whatever it is, it's just a marker. And I'll explain why in one of the future videos. But this, this is where I'm gonna come back, minus the camera one day, and give it absolutely everything I can to see what I can do when I empty the tank. Right, a few more minutes until we have to push on. So I think it's time to cheer some other runners and squirrels home. Let's see who we can find. What do you get, what, 17 minutes? Go on Mel, last hundred. Go on Jean. Go Jean, you got this. Go on guys, you've only got about another 15 miles to go. Go on, keep going. Great running, well done, well done Rain. Great one and everyone, well done. Great running guys, last 50, well done, great running. Well done Paul, good running mate. Last little Great running, well done. You'll be your YouTube star. Thank you. 50 meters, go for it. Oh, look at that, great finish, well done guys. Well done Heather. 50 meters, you got this mate. So that is all squirrels home. And I believe that's pretty much everybody home now as well. We uh, do have the tail walkers out, just making sure though. Um, so like I say, thoughts on the Abbey Park Park Run. Best one I've ever done. I know I've only done a few, um, but it's near flat, apart from the bridge over the River Saw that you cross twice. And like I say, 99.9% .9 of it is tarmac so it's perfect it really is perfect uh, it's a great venue uh, apparently there is free parking somewhere around here uh, somebody told me near a place called morningside arena you're meant to be able to get free parking i can't confirm that do have a look on the uh, website though there's more details on there i'm going to head back to my car i am going to stop for a bit of post-race fueling stay tuned i'll see if i can get a nice picture of that